Hello and welcome, this is Moose2006 and today we're going to be looking at a little bit of the forestry involved with Farming Simulator 15. We'll take a look at the chainsaw and then how to chop up your logs and haul them into the export area. So go ahead and buy a chainsaw, take it out and find a tree you want to chop down. Um, here's a nice wooded area, I chose it because it's sort of close to the lumberyard where we'll be taking them later. So, if you hold your right mouse button down and rotate uh, the chainsaw, you'll be able to cut it down. Now if I cut it this way, it's going to go to the left, which means the tree will then fall to the left, so I don't want to do that. I want to come around because I want the tree to go that way onto the road. So I'll find an area where the circle looks as flat as possible, kind of like there, and cut across, and then it should fall to my left. Perfect. All right, wait till it stops rolling. Now we want to take all the branches off, so just run across it with your chainsaw on, and it'll, well, I don't think I got much. Sort of, there we go. Just sort of run across it. Sometimes it doesn't want to register very well, but and it'll start cutting the branches off, which makes it a lot easier to work with, and I believe higher in uh, price to sell. So I'm just gonna get this guy off. Um, it's nice to pick a forest. Wow. It's nice to pick a forest that's not on the road because these cars are gonna get in my way. But um, I chose it again. I chose it because it's the it's close to the lumberyard. There's probably ones closer, but oh well. So now we need to chop it up into logs so that we can haul it. So let's talk a little bit about the haul, the difference in hauling um, trailers. There's this one. Uh, the nice thing about this one is that it has its own crane that you can pick the logs up with and then just put it there and take it to the lumber yard. The con, a really, really big con of this trailer is how short it is. You have to cut them into really small pieces, which really hurts the selling price. I like to use this one because, as you can see, it's really long, so you can keep the logs pretty long and manageable. It, it's a lot easier to transport them. If you do go ahead and get this trailer, uh, you have to make sure you get the dolly, the semi-trailer attachment, which is right under here. It's only, you know, it's not too expensive, so I think it's worth it. If you go to Forest Street, this is the long one I was showing you just now. It even says you need a dolly. And here is the smaller one that has its own crane. So you can decide <clears throat> which one works best for you. If you do pick this one, then you will need the log attachment for your front loader, uh, which is fairly cheap. So go ahead now, we'll chop up the logs. Um, I'm gonna show you both trailers, so we'll get one about this long. So now put it this way, because you're going to be cutting down. And if you, you don't really ever get a really good view of it, but you can just kind of trust. You can kind of see there's a blue circle there now. So go ahead and cut it. Looks a little angled, but oh well. You, you want to get the cuts as straight as possible. So there you have one log. I'll just do one more. I'll just kind of cut this end off. It's, it's, that, that end is fairly small. It's not going to be worth much. So again, I, I couldn't even see this before. I just have to trust that it's there. <coughs> Excuse me. There we go. So now we have three pieces. That one uh, just sort of did, it's, it's right there. Sort of glitched into the ground. So I'll put this away. I'm done with that. I will... Let's show you the independent crane one first. Um, this part might take a while because it can be a little finicky sometimes, but we'll see how good my skills are today. So park it right next to it. Get in. Alright, so if I fold out the feet with X, that'll make it more stable. Move the crane over, open it up, move it down, out a little bit. Okay, we'll see how this works. Close it up. 
<clears throat> so you can see it's this one's probably a little too long. Oh, a lot too long. Um, you really have to cut them super short if you're going to use this. Um, but it'll you know, it'll do. So go ahead and if I was just hauling this log, I could keep it in the in the hand of the crane. Um, but you usually want to load up a decent amount on there. So anyway, get it. Uh, I'm trying to get it to hit the back. There we go. Yeah, I'll drop it. It's not going to look good. So if you are going to have a lot of logs, my one piece of advice is to, when you're all the way done, say you have five or six logs on this thing, open it up all the way and then set it down right here in the middle and just lower it right in the center as much as possible like this and put some pressure on it. It'll kind of glitch out but it'll keep a little pressure on the log so when you drive they're not going to fall out and and scatter everywhere on the road. Um, it'll save you a lot of pain and heartache. So if you want to use that one, you know, go ahead. I used it for a long time. Oh, whoa. Okay. Some stutters there. Now this one, you're going to need this guy. So go ahead and um, yeah, I should probably move this. Uh, I should have unfolded the feet, but it should work. So you can see the log doesn't move much because I, I have that crane handle or hand uh, applying pressure to it. It, helps, it actually helps quite a bit, that little trick. So this is the one I probably should have picked up with that thing, but oh well. So for this, you just pick it up. Um, I'll go out a little bit. Go out a little bit. There we go. Face it down. Come down. And then, let's see, I want to close it. There we go. So you can figure out all the controls in the top the left, they'll give you little hints. Um, takes a little getting used to, sorry for the performance issues. I'm not sure why this game does that. I don't know if it's opt not optimized very well or something's with my computer. No idea, but that's, that's how it is. So then you just come over here. <clears throat> So it's super easy. Uh, let's see. Open up, open up, open up. And there you go. You can put a, t a lot more on there. Basically, whatever you think your tractor can handle. So there is the chainsaw and how to take the branches off, how to cut the logs up, how to put them on your trailer. Wow, this is. I'm s really sorry for that. It, this game does that for me sometimes. It also crashes, oddly, quite a bit, but, you know, it is what it is. So now I'll probably, so now I'm going to take it to the lumber yard, which is just a little bit north of here. All right, so here's the lumber yard. Um, if you go, there's basically two areas you can take it. To the left over there, there's a yellow box, kind of like you do for wool, where you just drive it in and it disappears. But you don't get as much money doing that. You want to throw them here in the lake. So this is where your like simulation um, side can come out. If you're really into the simulator aspect of this, you can park this, go get your front loader, drive it here, pick up the log, throw it in the, the lake, get the money. If you don't care that much, if you have like 20 logs on here and you just really don't want to do all that, you can also do a little, you know, cheat. Uh, it's a little tricky with the semi-trailer, but basically if you just drive it in. Oh, well, that's not fun. If you just drive it in, maybe this will be... And better, better. And there you go. I got some money. Um, and then from here, you can try to drive it out. Or, of course, since that happened, you can um, go to your... <coughs> Excuse me, your reset screen, reset them back to your farm. I like to get the front loader and, you know, actually put them in and not do this, but for time's sake and the sake of the video, I decided to show the little, um, what I would call a, a, a cheat there. But play as you will. So there you go, there's the chainsaw, the, the trailers, 
and how to sell the lumber. If you load up the trailer with a bunch of lumber, you can make a lot of money off forestry, just a ton of money. Um, I just did one log for time's sake. So I hope that helps. I'm really sorry for all the performance and stutter issues, but I hope the video helped nonetheless. If it did, please leave a like or a comment. And if it did not help, if, if there's anything that you uh, didn't get or didn't enjoy, please also leave a comment letting me know that so that I can improve that in my next video. Thank you very much and have a nice day.